Our topic is 9th Standard Geography Lesson 1 India Size. India is such a huge vast country that the area is 3.28 million square kilometer which accounts 2.5% of the total geographical area of the world. At 22 degrees latitude, it is southern part that tapers down and is surrounded on all the three sides by the water body and so it is a peninsular India. Peninsular India towards the west lies the Arabian Sea, towards the south lies the Indian Ocean, towards the east lies the Bay of Bengal. As a part of the Indian territory, there we have the group of the islands. Islands refer to the land surface which is surrounded on all the sides by the water body. And so in the Arabian Sea, there we have the Lakshadweep Island. In the Bay of Bengal, there we have the Andaman and Nicobar Island. At 22 degrees, since the southern part tapers down, so it is a peninsula. To the south of it, there is the Indian Ocean. And it is inverted triangle. If it would not have been there, then the Indian Ocean would have covered the entire southern part. So it is inverted peninsular triangle. Inverted peninsular triangle. Therefore, this Indian Ocean is divided into the two water bodies. Towards the west is the Arabian Sea. Towards the east is the Bay of Bengal. Now it is very interesting to know how come the term Arabian Sea used for this water body. It is reason being towards the west of it there lies the Arabian Peninsula. These Arabs were the traders who sailed towards India to trade and were the first to coin the word monsoon from their Arabic word mosam. Now towards the east is the Bay of Bengal. Bay refers to the water body that protrudes towards the land surface. The word attached Bengal to it reason the British had their first factory in Bengal and so they coined the word Bay of Bengal. Now it is from the westernmost part of India, Gujarat, extending extreme south, then further towards the southeast in West Bengal. It has a huge coastline and that is 7516.6 kilometers. Towards the north, if we see, it has a land frontier. Land frontier refers when the nation shares the land boundary with the other country. And so it has a land frontier of 15,200 kilometers. It is such a huge land frontier that it shares its border land frontier with seven neighboring countries and to very easy way to know these seven immediate neighbors are through the statement Punjab National Bank hires MCA. Here each initial letter stands for our neighboring country. P for Pakistan, M for Nepal, B for Bhutan, B again for Bangladesh, MCA for Myanmar, China and Bangladesh. Thus, there we have the seven immediate neighbors of India learnt through the very simple statement. India, you know that the seventh largest country. So, as a citizen of the country, we need to know the six other large countries than India. Through, we all know the first three English alphabets. You can rank. And so, these letters are A for Australia, B for Brazil, C for China. You can rank. U stands for USC, can for Canada, R for Russia. Ultimately, we get the rank in a descending order and so we come to know the countries larger than India in the order itself. There we have it, the southernmost tip of the mainland of India in Kanyakumari and the northernmost tip of the, the India in Jammu and Kashmir. The distance is 3214 km. While from the westernmost tip to the easternmost tip of India, the distance is 2933 km. If we look at this map, we get the illusion as if the westernmost tip to the easternmost tip of India is uh, covering more distance than the southern to the northern part of India. The reason being there, the longitudes they converge at the poles while the latitudes they are the parallel lines and so the illusion being there western to the eastern tip of India the distance is more. The latitudinal extent of India is 8 degree 4 minutes north to 37 degrees 8 minutes north. 30 degrees difference. Longitudinal difference from the westernmost tip 68 degrees 7 minutes east to the 97 degree 25 minutes which makes a difference of about 30 degrees and so the, the difference being the 30 degrees but the illusion being there just because of the longitudes 